analysis has finished. So similar to what you've used to seeing, quite a few things that I changed because as a player there's certain things that are frustrating to me. So if you just look at board one, for example, if you were east-west, how many tricks could you take in no trump? And what's displayed at the bottom is the total number of tricks that you could take, not in bridge notation, but in regular English. So if north was playing no trump, they can take 11 tricks, 12 in spades. For east-west, uh, they can only take one trick if they are playing in no trump. Very frustrating for me to, you know, play in one no trump and not know how many tricks I was supposed to be able to take. So that's something a little bit different. If we look at board five, we'll show that if, for example, in this one, east-west can't take any tricks with clubs as trumps. So we just show that as a dash. One of the, see when I move the mouse over, you see these uh, two little icons that keep popping up. One of the things you should never do, if it's a random deal, is to be able to edit the cards. However, if you are at a club that does shuffle and play, and you're the non-playing director, and during sit-outs, what you want to be able to do, or it would be nice to be able to do, is to uh, enter the particular hand records. So, I'm giving an example here. You grab a hold of this board, and you look at the north hand, and you can start selecting the cards that that north player has. You know, very nice and easy. And as soon as we've got the 13 cards, it automatically moved on to east, and then on to south. And that is our hand record. So again, I'm assuming this is a shuffle and play. I'm going to save that hand record and we'll notice that it automatically updates the double dummy analysis for that single board. And if we print this using the default print option, again, notice that it's common with websites to have a different looking visual presentation on a screen and how it actually looks on the uh, when, it, when it finally gets printed out. So we have the ability here, being able to generate hand records, generate them on the fly using world-class software to be able to create it. In this case, it's uh, uh, software that other people have provided, same software that the WBF use.